Today we're going to work with bringing EPS images and using them in vector format in Affinity Designer. So let's get started. I'm working in the artboard page. So this is what we're going to end up with. So I just have another one copied over here to get started. So we want to do something quick and easy. We just want to transfer some silhouette images onto this to create a nice little picture. We're going to grab our clouds from Vecteezy. The link is in the description below. Click free download and you're going to download it into a zip file. Once you have the zip file downloaded, you're going to go ahead and extract it wherever you want it. I already have mine opened up. Once you have it downloaded and unzipped, It's very easy just to grab your file and drag it over onto your page. Control and scroll out. And let's just shrink this down because it's pretty big. This is an EPS file. Now, as you can see, we can't really work with it like it is. So what we're gonna do is with this EPS file selected, click Edit Documents. It's going to open up into a new tab. You'll see up here, this is Untitled, and this is going to open up into a new tab here. Now, the only thing we need to do, we can see this EPS file is in layers now, and they're already in curves. That means in vector format. Select the cloud that you want to use and control C is going to copy it. Open your other tab back up. And let's move that out of the way. Select the board that you want to use and control V to paste it in. Okay. Now I want to show you something else with this. If you make changes to this page, it's going to be reflected in on this page here. So let's take this cloud and let's cut it. Control X. Okay, so now it's gone. And it's also gone from this page. So whatever you do in this file it will be reflected here, but it won't be reflected in the file you have saved on your computer. And Control V. Okay, we've got another cloud there. So let's go back over here and grab another cloud. Now let's get some animals and trees. This file will also be listed in the description, the animal silhouettes. Drag it and drop it onto your affinity page. And let's shrink that down as well. What we're going to do with this one is the same thing. Let's edit document. It's going to open in a new tab. You can really create something that is cute and unique pretty quickly from free EPS files. Thanks guys, give me a thumbs up if you like this video. 